Hello friends, welcome to Quantum Espresso tutorial. This is lab 2, uh, convergence of a K point. Simply you can say that the K point is nothing but high symmetry point of a first brilliant charm in a reciprocal space. Here we use automatic K point. These are the folding factors and these are the shifting factors. These folding factors of K point which mostly depend on cell dimensions and uh, these shifting factors which helps us to reduce a K point mostly in a 3D symmetry cell except hexagonal. For hexagonal we have to choose uh, it 0 0 0 because in hexagonal case shifting increase the number of k points as well as time of calculation this is the input file of graphite and we know that the graphite is a case of metal and for metal we have to add a few steps occupation and degauss actually the calculation converts smoothly Otherwise, in some case, the calculation take too long time to converge or do not converge after hundreds of iteration. So I suggest to add a smearing in the case of metal. Here by default, smearing method is a Gaussian. So I didn't specify here. Uh, and smearing width is a 0.1 Rydberg. Now we have a two file, graphite input file. And uh, should a potential file now we have to converge k point with respect to total energy so first of all i wrote here 2 2 2 uh, folding factor for k point and 0 0 0 factors of uh, k points then save this file by save as 2.e and save as type this save as type is keep as all files and then save now change this as 444 file and save as 4 dot in save as type all five then save do this process uh, up to 20 20 20 so we have 10 different input file means 2 dot in 4 dot in 6 dot in as well as up to 20 dot in okay we have this input files suppose 20 dot in means there is the k points 20 20 20 0 0 0 now open a notepad and write command for compilation of this all file pw input file 2.in then write name of output file as you want suppose I wrote here 2.out then pw input file 4.in we have then 4.out right up to 20.in and 20.out then go to file menu then save as uh, name uh, give a name of file suppose uh, here i wrote auto run then dot b a t for extension of batch file and save as type is equal to all file and then click on save button so we have one windows batch file here now uh, press shift and then press uh, right button 
on mouse so we have a open command windows here option then click on it now just type auto run dot pat and press the process is running wait for 10 to 15 minutes now we have all output file here now we have to search for total energy in this output file or by open open the documents and search the total energy with a strict mark this is the final energy this is fermi energy also or you can uh, directly search uh, total energy from different file with a single command uh, now press shift and then right click open command windows type find we want to find a strict marks line start with a strict marks actually from output file all output files so here i wrote star dot out and want to copy this all search line in a single file suppose output file output dot txt and then press enter the process is done here we have output file double click on it we have energies from different output file now go to excel file write k point in first column and then total energy or absolute energy and then energy difference means delta i we know the folding factor of k points is 222 two, two, then 444 666 we can write up to 20 20 20 okay now write respective uh, total energy as per k points from the output file so for 222 search 2 dot out okay this is the total energy up uh, for a 222 k points in ry copy then paste same as for four 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 in four dot out copy and paste do these steps uh, for all other files now we have all data here write 0 for reference in a 20 then find a difference between this last two energy write equal to sign and then b means uh, total energy for 20k points 20 20 20k points minus total energy for 18 18 18 k points copy this cell select this all cells and change its format by format cells 
number it increases decimal point up to eight okay this is the difference between two uh, consecutive total energies we can clearly see that for point k for the value of k point six 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 the energy is uh, converse because the energy difference uh, reduce after this point so for a good assumption we can say that 666 is a k points or you can say 10 10 10 for a better calculation now other method is to draw graph of total energy versus k points select this two column and insert then draw scattered with a smooth line and markers this is our graph let this series right click sorry right click and move chart to new sheet total energy versus k point you can change the layout by chart title here you can write sorry, chart title above chart total energy versus k points convergence of k points now axis title horizontal axis this is horizontal axis on horizontal axis we have k points so write k points x x x point now axis title for vertical axis right total energy Okay, and last select this line horizontal line, right click format axis and axis level at low. Now, this is our perfect XY graph. Here you can say that after this six point the graph is conversed so we choose k point in our further calculation as a six 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 zero 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 or you can also draw grid line for watching my videos